How we doing today, guys? Good to see all of you. Welcome to you. Welcome to you. We're playing some Lethal Company. We're gonna be playing with uh, Zeke JP and I believe Gassy Mexican. Friend of the channel, great dude. Very much looking forward to it. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and fire it up, and we'll see how we're doing. One Punch Mac with that 76 months, and he says, "Woohoo!" Thank you, One Punch. Always a pleasure having you here, dude. Always a pleasure, my friend. Hmm. <clears throat> Boop, boop, boop. Version 4.5. Oh, man. Mm. I am ready for some quota. Hey, Super SP. What's up, buddy? <clears throat> what's Lethal Company? Oh, you'll see. Hope everyone's having a killer Sunday. Hope you are too, dude. Hell yeah. Co is a great asset. Oh, thank you. Am I playing it modded? I'm not sure yet. I think we're going to talk about that. Mm. Mm. Who's the fourth player? Uh, Gats Mexican, I believe. Jiggle for me, Co. I, I'm working on it, buddy. Woo! <clears throat> Gotta make my money somehow. <clears throat> I'm I'm actually twerking right now under my desk. If that helps. Yeah. Doing a doing a, a twerk right now. Hello. Hmm. Speaking of twerking, how you doing, Zeke? Oh, I twerked uh, too much yesterday, and I uh, I threw my back out. Threw your back? Oh, man. Yeah. I was just telling Chad, I actually twerk for subs now. Um, I just do it in my chair, you know, while I'm, while I'm streaming. Oh. Yeah. I'm actually well, twerking you're right twerking now. you're twerking a lot. I'm twerking right now. Um, I'm doing a good, I'm, I'm doing a twerk. <laughs> is, that, is that how they say it? Is it? I think, okay. Mm. <laughs> So I think Max is getting coffee and JP I think is running intros. So Max has been playing with a ton of mods and I think we're gonna we're gonna maybe add some mods in to our fun experience as well. Potentially we'll see. Yes, yes, I heard that as well. Um someone sent me the the one mod that I really wanted was the the just to press press the button to mute to your oh you know, yeah. to your yeah. team. So I can like, you know, talk. If I need to talk to my chat, I can mute the game easily, or mute mute me to the game. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. If I need to call someone out or talk shit or whatever. <laughs> indeed, indeed, in indubitably. Mm-hmm. So, how uh, how uh, much did you get down on the uh, that once human? I have played once human probably like 15 hours, 15, 20 hours. Yeah. Okay. Still loving yeah. it. Yeah. It's become uh it's become my off stream game. Really? <clears throat> yeah. I've been uh I've been I, I was looking for a a builder like survival, I guess, to just yeah. turn off my brain and kind of play and it's been pretty good. It's got it's got goals, which yes. is I think what I need out of out of games like this. It's interesting because uh, it I it's and it's funny you say that. A lot of people have dropped in and just like I'll be you know building my base and you know just walking around harvesting stuff. And even someone today was like, "Man, this looks exactly like Rust." And I was like, "It there is Rust in here. It is like Rust if there was like RPG goals in it too." And then I like brought yeah. up the map and I was like, "You know, you start here at level one and then you move through here to level five, and then level ten, and then level fifteen, and it's like." 
you know, so it, it basically, in, in a lot of ways, it is Rust, but it's like in this nice kind of gamified RPG framework with like a little bit of Cthulian control vibes in there, and it's uh, mm -hmm. it works. Uh, speaking of which, though, it's funny. Somebody actually dropped in. I see now that JP is unmuted. Somebody dropped in and was like, what up? Somebody dropped in and goes, hey, Ko, I know you're loving Once Human. I can't wait to hear you and JP talk about it because he hates it. <laughs> I mean, I don't know if I hate it, but that's exactly what I, said. I was like, my type of game. That's exactly what I said. I was like, I bet he just doesn't really, like, it's not really his kind of thing, so. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Like, I, yeah. I preferred, uh, I just went back to Fortnite and played more of that. There you go. Lego? Uh, Lego Fortnite or just OG Fortnite? Just, <laughs> just OG Fortnite. You know, oh. me and Mr. Meeseeks just, uh, <laughs> yeah. Hell yeah, dude. No, no, no. Le Lego Fortnite uh, is what right I on, went man. back for. Yeah. Um, very cool. Yeah, Very cool. Uh, I'm, I think I'm like one of the few people that actually didn't enjoy Once Human, funny enough. Well, I mean... It seems like everyone's ranting and raving about it. Like I said to that guy, it's it's a flavor. Like, it's not doing... It's, it's not only a flavor. It's not really doing anything particularly that new. So it's like all mm. the stuff in Once Human has been done before in other games. In fact, um, it, it's basically like this old game I used to love called Defiance with like a building right. mechanic. <laughs> it's like, which is yeah. great. Like for me, I love Defiance. It's great. But it's like, if that's not really your thing, then, you know, this isn't gonna, it's not gonna win you over if that's not your genre. Yeah, <clears throat> my, my biggest gripe about it was the fact that I spawned into the world and I was in everyone else's mess. Which is yeah. a really weird thing, but just like being surrounded by everyone else's like- half finished ass house. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, like half finished shit. I was just, I was just like immediately put off. And yeah. that's, that's a me thing. I want yeah. like a clean, pristine it world. Ain't nothing wrong with that, man. It also is totally immersion breaking when you just see like totally, random yeah. boxes all over the place. I agree, I agree. <laughs> some are finished, uh, some don't have roofs. Some are just, you know, like it's a-, it's a But it's hey, a now, now listen, some people like <laughs> it Do you that feel way, attacked? Okay? <laughs> yeah, I think, Zeke, I think we're attacking Zeke here. Um, Dude, I spent like a solid hour and a half like building my house and like it, it's it's pretty cool. It, you know, that part of it's pretty cool. I don't know if we, what do we want to talk about this next drop frames or do we just want to like talk about it today since we're not having a drop uh, frames? Well, know. we probably won't do another drop frames till, unless we do one next week. Well, next week is, is Xmas oh, that's Eve, a Christmas so Eve probably, not. probably not. So. Yeah, we, well, <laughs> we could do it Xmas Eve or we could do it New Year's Eve. What do you got? <laughs> yeah, well, well, there you go, man. We're kind of, we're kind of screwed there. Screwed um, either way. Yeah, I think the next show will be the uh, the seventh, uh, the the, new, the game of the year show. Cool. But, so we can talk about it now, by all means. <laughs> if there's anything else left to uh, to discuss about. My, it. The only uh, thing I I would leave off on is like if you are into like online looter shooter survival games, it is definitely a game to keep your eye on. Um, it's by Netties, which of course made me super concerned about like sure. the cosmetics and everything. But there's been this uh, or the, the the pay to win aspect. But there was a, a guy on my channel named Guardian who's kind of like a liaison with them. He, he kind of like a half dev almost. And yeah. uh, he got me a quote that I thought kind of was hilarious. So this this is this is the quote, like word for word. This is from the NA marketing director. We don't want pay to win stuff either. We will just sell cosmetic packs. We might do a battle pass, but I don't think so. That It's not that, and then he says in quotes, fun. And then here's the best part. We don't like any kind of pay to win in the studio. So NetEase has to quote, either kill us all or replace us. <laughs> Jeez, okay. And I was like, Damn. so that's a- uh, That's kind of cool. That's some, that's some dedication. That's a vibe. <laughs> yeah. That's kind of cool. Somebody in chat after oh. I said that immediately was like, you know, Netties has an army of ninjas, right? You you know, you know that they will say, they will, they will hunt you down. They, yeah, that, don't that threaten them like that it. against their pay to win. <laughs> Jesus, that studio is not going to be there next year. <laughs> I know, right? But I will say that's that's a super cool stance to take. Now, of course, you know, at who knows? I mean, Netties is a giant corporation. Who knows what strong arm thing they'll do? But it's clear the devs want to keep it as non pay to win as possible, which is honestly one of the reasons I'm so attracted to it. I think that's awesome. Yeah. Like huge respect. I'll buy one of every cosmetic if you keep pay to win out of it. <laughs> <laughs> buy a damn wardrobe. My, I mean, my only like complaint is is just the the regular complaint. It's it's beta. It's there's there's glitches, there's bugs. Not everything works like correctly. Not everything is translated, which is kind of. Yeah, I mean, I guess that can add a, a layer of fun if you just gotta like have your Google lens like handy at all times to see. Like, I went into this like instance, and it was like, you know, uh, uh, Mandarin character, Mandarin character, twenty four. 
three, two, seven. I was like, okay, I don't know what what I'm doing. <laughs> what am I doing here? Yeah. So I had to like put up the the Google lens, and it was like, ah, kill Colonel Josh. And you're like, oh, okay, thanks. That's that's all I really needed to know. <laughs> that's all you got to know. Find Just Colonel Josh. Know who to shoot? <laughs> yep, <Yeah>. exactly. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Love it, dude. But and there was this one mission that I couldn't. That was so funny. I couldn't complete it. Uh, because it seemed like there was no door into this place and I'm like maybe there's a secret door somewhere and then I was like I searched around for like a good 15 good minutes show. and I finally was like I gotta go see you I, I, I looked online and they're like no you actually have to glitch through the door using Bro! your motorcycle and I was like engineer what, say, what? No, that can't be right so I did subs. it and I went in there and there's no door it was just a little like like three by two box with no doorway, no stairs, no nothing in there. You have to cl you have to actually clip through the wall because they forgot to put a fucking door in there or something. So Jeez. funny, <laughs> funny story. This this is an actual beta. There's like big swaths of the game that aren't done. Like the entire bottom of the skill tree isn't done. A bunch of stuff is still in Japanese. A lot of the voice acting is missing, stuff like that. So there's a very good point or a very good chance that you just ran into just a 100% bug. Like they decided to do this because uh, from what I understand, they didn't want to wait until later, essentially, to stress test their server architecture. They just wanted to turn it on, let people mess around, right. and that way they could develop their server architecture in tandem with finishing their game to hopefully get the game out faster. Um, it's But funny enough, they had like these set goals. We want this many people, you know, and that's it. And they were, they were planning on an open beta. And the beta was open, as for those that, that don't know. You could just download yeah. it and everyone could play. But then yeah. it kind of caught on fire when they got seven times the amount of people in the first week that they were planning on for the entire six month block. So they yeah. were like, okay, we're gonna become a closed beta. <laughs> and now what they're doing is the servers are completely closed and you can actually go to the website, onesuman.game and sign up for it. And as, as they monitor active players leaving every Friday, they bring in X thousand new players to kind of keep the population stable, so. But yeah, it's only up for what, like three more weeks? Uh, they more said weeks? they said mid January. I don't know if they've given a, an exact okay. day, but I, I Julia today was talking about. She's like, I don't know what I'm gonna do when this game closes. Like, there's, there's. Yeah, just, I yeah. saw Gathalian was saying the same thing. Yeah, right? they're both super into it. It's great, man. It's like it's like my new big uh, my new big morning game, and I'm I'm loving it. Like, just always something to to do or see or goals to set, and yeah, if they actually nice. keep it pay to win. Not pay to win. Like it's I think it's gonna be huge. Not pay to win, yeah. They actually keep it not pay to win. If they keep it not pay to win, it's gonna be one of the first games of this caliber free to play that isn't. Like they could they could like set records with this. So let's hope they stick to it. Cool. Yeah. They, they will also unfortunately make an absolute metric ass ton of money if they lean into the pay to win. And I know and I know they know that too, which is, you know, a yeah. thing. Yeah, it's tough. It's it's tough not to not Sell to out. listen to the devil, devil on your shoulder yeah. with bags of cash. Yep. Like, look at this. Look at all this bags. These bags of cash I have for you. And you know that Netties is going to be just breathing down their neck. Oh you know? yeah, oh, with the 100%. success of it. Hundred percent. Absolutely. It. Yep. Yeah. Oh man. No, like the what I wanted. Like, <laughs> yeah, there are, there are times as gamers when you're just like. Why can't this game and this game mash together with all the great stuff and make like my like super awesome great game? And I I mean I just recently checked out Seven Days to Die and uh, I wish that the progression and the like the bosses and you know that kind of like there's a point. It feels like there's a point to yep. um, uh, Once Human and Seven Days to Die. The point is to survive and I've I've never really like jibe with that but i i love the gameplay in seven days die and how everything is destructible everything works and you know it's been around for 10 years so like you know they've been perfecting it uh that way i just want like you know i would love there to be like bosses like you go to an instance and you fight a boss and uh you know it it they lock stuff behind that I, I, like like valheim as well you mm -hmm. know they, they you know yeah. progression is locked behind you know you have to build, you have to beat bosses in order to see more of the game. And what's like, so I cool, like what's so great is like, whenever you beat a boss in Once Human, you'll go back to your base and start building. 
and all of us uh, all of a sudden like literally tons and tons of blueprints that you unlocked the ability to get from killing that boss show up as locked whenever you see that so you get back to your base and even though you haven't delegated any skill points yet when you go to build next you're just like whoa what is all this new stuff and then you have to like go look through your trees and like you know figure out what's what and it, it's a it's a very very cool take on that i haven't seen that before but it's yeah it's yeah it's it's good it's good it doesn't feel like an mmo i'll just i'll say that it's not yeah it, it's I not an mmo it's, it's an it, MMO. online okay. online multiplayer it's like yeah around a lot yeah, the, oh, okay, okay. MMO MMO is kind of like indie, where it it was rooted in meaning a specific thing, but over time it's come to mean something else. And, okay. And MMO, the key the key word of, in MMO is the first letter, massively. And if you only see a few other players when you're running around, there is nothing massively about that. Like that's that's just an online multiplayer game. That's just you know. So that's that's kind of what this is it's what destiny is it's what warframe is it's what path of exile is like they're you know you can play online with your buddies and you can do stuff with them and it's really easy to but it's not you're not all in the same kind of world or few instances of the same world yeah uh how many bosses have you downed co i think i just killed the i want to say the third one i just killed the uh okay. it's not really a spoiler it just killed the treant if you've done him no i tried we tried uh tried downing it and uh, or i excuse me i tried alone and that's not something you like i wasn't leveled enough to do yeah. it alone i think you probably can i have but... spent a <laughs> lot of time all of my armor is t2 with full of mods my guns are all t2 everything's calibrated i've got full mods and everything like i'm using up my ammo like yeah it's what kind of what, what are your what's your gun loadout out of curiosity what, what two guns are you using uh I've, I've been switching back and forth to see which ones i like the best but honestly, uh, the ones that have that have jived best with me, I just got a a, a tier two. Uh, what is blue? Rare? You say yeah, blue is yeah, rare. Yeah. I just got a tier two uh, rare sniper rifle that oh, I really am nice. enjoying, and I got a a, 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 a quite disappointing purple like uh, shotgun. shotgun. Yeah, yeah. The little the little double shot thing. I agree. <laughs> it was pretty disappointing, but I'll, I'll tell you this: like my. And there's Max. Oh, what's up, I, Gassy? I was here already. Oh, he's been here the whole time 20 minutes ago, Did right? Did you hit you the just... microphone? <laughs> I bumped my desk when I got up. That's what you heard. You heard a little <laughs> You're like, that's a telltale sign of a streamer doing something with their mic. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I set, I set my alarm for 1030. And for some reason, I don't know why, uh, they had, you know, Monday, Saturday, Monday, everything except for Sunday on there. And I don't know why, because I don't set alarms like that. So I don't know if it was one of those things where the iPhone just sets it out of habits, because Sunday's my day off. Weird, Weird one. That's the way mine is set. Mine is set every day except Monday. Yeah. Anyway, Hi. Uh, just to finish Hi. my sentence. Uh, <laughs> uh, my hey, you acknowledge me. Don't don't I put mean, that on me. <laughs> I was using the sniper <laughs> rifle and the uh, the it's it's weird it's a revolver but it only has five shots which is fucking weird you can't see me but i'm but... holding up the please wrap it up sign yeah got it that's it that's <laughs> no that's that's awesome dude i feel you i feel you i'm using the but, uh, uh the yeah. shrapnel assault rifle and uh the pump action shotgun and it is ooh, ooh, ooh. I, I haven't found a pump yet ooh, ooh, it's what, what game y'all talking about once human yeah. oh i've heard nothing but good things from that uh if, if you want access uh let me know we can get streamer keys yeah it's... i I, uh, I saw a little bit of my buddies like playing it, um, but it looked pretty, pretty neat. It's, it's a neat monster like design too, as well. It is yeah. super keen. <laughs> yeah. The thing I would say that I've told people who like, oh, I want to check it out. Like it's beta, it's in beta. So you're gonna, you're gonna encounter some beta ass things like, yeah. oh yeah. You know, the dialogue, is not, the dialogue and voice acting is terrible. <laughs> it's just bad. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and the translations are not 100% there. Yep. So sometimes you have to use your Google Lens translate that that simplified Chinese. Yeah. Fair enough. All right, mods. What are yeah, we doing? So I have several oh, yeah. mod packs that are already um like good to go just from just previous lobbies that I've been in. Um that's probably the easiest way. Um mod you need packs. Thunderstorm Mod Manager. We should all have that because we did an eight player game. And I think that's yeah, exactly what we had to download. Or so you guys yeah. have done yeah, okay. You've yes. done that already then um let me look at the mods on this one we yeah, are we one. are some like monster mods i don't know if we all needed to have those max or if you just have to host it then they work or what i think generally speaking 
you give somebody the code for for the thing and then they can use the mod manager to do that just to make sure that it works i think oh man i don't know if it's one of those things where you people can just like grab the mods from the host as they're they're loading in um i always err on the side of like hey just get the mod so removes potential yeah. point of you know issues i think that's smart yeah if you just want to list them off we can go through them i don't know how many you have does anyone I, I know, know what folder it installs under is it like curse board or something? oh well, I when you no got idea. Well, that's what Overwolf. I'm saying. Like, it's in the Overwolf folder. Okay. If you guys have just thun the, if you just have Thunderstorm on Manager, I can just give you a code and you can that's import perfect. that thing and it. Good oh, to go. I didn't Let's know that, that was a thing. Yeah, give give that's, us that. That's that's. <laughs> I have another friend who's like really against using Thunder Thunderstorm because they usually have issues with it for some reason. So I don't know if it was that thing happening. Like, well, you know, just give us the mods. You know, just, no, 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 I didn't know that it had like the import code stuff. Yeah. I we're we're yes. all three terrible modders, and the easier the better. Like we don't. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so give you we, the code. we yeah. bring it up. Yeah. I've never done a a code import. Do we just click the little import update button? Yeah. So make sure. Yeah, you have uh, Lethal Company obviously selected, and then it'll be import update, and I will give you the code. Beautiful. Import new profile moment. from code. Ooh, code. Okay. Fun. Yep. Where Where are you putting these, uh, Max? Uh, I guess I'll put it in this chat for our you can voice. Put it right here, yeah. I just, yeah. I've never chatted in this chat before. I just put test in here. You should be able to see it. Mm -hmm. Oh, it, oh, that's cool. I didn't I didn't realize they had chat channels with them now. All right. Let me see here. Now, Max, do these codes need to be private? Does it matter? No. Okay, cool. Making sure. Didn't know if I needed to hide the screen mods. or anything. Yeah. It's a long string of numbers, so if anybody Ooh. did grab it, it's like, okay. <laughs> I'm trying to grab it too myself here. I probably could just get it from this old chat. It's from like another lobby that I did recently. I didn't put this mod pack together, but it's fairly updated. Plus you just hit update all once you import it. If any of the yeah. mods say like, hey, this needs to be updated. Give me a moment to grab the code. <clears throat> what have we done so far today nothing we're just we're just about to get started yeah just talked about one human a little bit and gassy rolled in with a cup of coffee and now we're about to play some games Gonna be a nice chill Sunday afternoon. Easy like Sunday morning. <laughs> did Squad Stream on Twitch just die out? So they did announce that they're canceling Squad Stream completely. I don't know if they yeah. if they've done it, Is already. it gone I th already. I thought it was going to be at least. I thought they announced like early next year. They're rolling out this big, this big new thing called Stream Together, which is right. this new amalgamation of stuff. And, and I've seen a bunch of channels already have that, but I don't oh, know if it's like really. Uh, well, I should say not a bunch of channels. I've seen a lot of OTK members have that, but that might just ah. be through <clears> their <throat> their Clancy uh, connection. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I don't, I don't know how that works. But Co, you know, as a member of OTK now, uh, you should be able to uh, to help us out with that, right? Sir, I think he's the leader of OTK, isn't he? Something I, like that, I yeah. lead yeah. Co TK. Co it's a completely separate organization. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And that is the Co True King streaming group that only I am a member of. Ah, yeah. Yeah. all right, I got it now. <clears throat> Took me a second to figure out where it was. Oh, Jesse Dodger okay. and Sims have been using it for their show too. Interesting. Oh, interesting. Yeah, I don't. I mean, Barry would probably know. Probably. Know. He, prob he probably he probably probably freaking made it, JP. Let's be real. Barry. Yeah. There you go. Oh, there's the code. Okay. Yeah, I got that it. It just took me a second. Of, I I had been using it, codes, but I hadn't actually created a code. The mods. The mods. And you. <clears throat> the mods. Yeah. The only one that makes sure to disable because I don't think it was working when we were playing was the. Um... Oh wow. Okay, that was very easy. Wow, that's yep. it. Where do you put it? It? Should, it should already be disabled. Oh, Just make I'm... sure the I can smell you one is disabled. Oh. As fun as that might be. <laughs> it oh, doesn't work, apparently. Oh, yeah. It's disabled by default. 
Great. It should okay. be. Yeah, Perfect. I think I disabled it. And then if it says update all, to do that. If it doesn't say update all, then you're good to go. And you hit modded pl- blue button in the top right. Where do I plug that that code into? So yeah, on you have lethal company selected, and it's like new profile or whatever in the um, mod store thingy. Oh, I'm Under looking store. at my my lethal company mod page. There yeah, we you go. Okay. Back out, Zeke. Okay. And then go to new profile. You want to make yeah. a new profile. Create or import slash update. Uh, Let me look at your screen. No, I'm not. I, I don't have it pulled up because. Show it! AP no. told me not to. <laughs> what? That was well, a, where oh, are you at in Thunderstorm mod manager? <laughs> have you selected, like, oh, have okay. you selected Lethal Company in, in Thunderstorm? Uh. Yeah, it's, yep. Okay. Select the game. Oh, we do have stream together. Oh, Select there we it. go. Okay, okay. And so then you create, see a button that says profile. import slash update. Yes. Click there. that, and then it'll say import um, new profile. Aha. And then use that code, code that I gave you. Got it. Yeah, and then once once it's, you know, gone in, then you select that profile. Um, You can name it, whatever. I think it's default called the mods. Yep. And then you select that profile. It'll load the mods. Um, just make sure that everything's updated. There shouldn't be a button in the top right that's like yellowish or a notification if it if it needs updating. It might not. Nope, they're all updated. And then you pl- press the blue modded button. In the okay, top and right. that's a, the, uh, the one that it, there's only one disabled. I smell you. That's it. Yep. <laughs> I smell you. Yeah, yeah. I smell okay. you. That was, one, that was one that was a part of this. I guess that was made like by a viewer. This is a, from a previous lobby recently. I guess okay. it didn't work. So. Cool. Yep, I am launching this now. Yeah, so we, I, I do have that stream together beta thing, but I don't know what I'm doing with it, so I'm not gonna. I have no idea. Also, where do, uh, <laughs> about that. where do you see that, AP? It's just oh, stream together, dashboard. right there. Yeah, but when you open it, it like turns into a. Uh, yeah, I it's see like it. A Skype call thing, and so Start I don't know how we together. Backstage activity will be what? Yeah, oh God, so that, that's this. where it like it, it's a Skype. Oh, thing. oh, yeah. Let's not do this. I don't want to mess. <laughs> we'll do that later. <laughs> that's one of those. Yeah, yeah, it's one of those things. We'll probably tested. Yeah, it, yeah, yeah. It seemed neat from what I've heard and seen of it. You know. Yeah. Uh, oh, all right. Who's gonna host? I can uh, host no oh, problem. Real quick, what what mods do we have that are oh, not no, no, no. like just cosmetic? But don't tell us. How about, how about we don't know? Let's let's not. Yeah, oh, I'd rather not know. Yeah. Let's... Initially, what if totally we, yeah you you don't know? And <laughs> never mind. Stupid stupid thing. Do Sorry, lie. I said it. <laughs> <laughs> that was I. Nope. Sorry. <laughs> All right. Who's who's hosting and inviting? I am Max hosting is. and inviting. I am. I'm hosting it right. Now, I feel uh, so before hosting. you join, before you join in the main menu, though, uh, bottom right, there's a green button. You can choose to what you want to put on, if anything. Oh, yeah, they have, they have little cosmetics. If you want to be a oh, little silly. Wow. All right. Are, is this modded or is this part of the new thing? Modded. Got it. OK. If you see that, you've already done the mods correctly, which is a good Hooray! thing. Hooray! It says I'm streaming together now. Oh, God, does it? What did uh-huh. I do? <laughs> Did you can- I just cancel out of it. Who am I streaming with? Oh god, it does say I'm streaming together. Who who though? What happens when I click on that? And nothing. Okay. I have no idea what's going on. 